Hey, good morning, Merry Christmas, Happy Hanukkah, whatever this is. It's Sunday morning. It's a Sabbath day. It's the day of the Sabbath. <laughs> Black Sabbath. <laughs> I, I, um, I find the inner peace and the inner strength within, you know. I'm not assured or comforted by the uh, religions, the, the, the multiple thousands, thousands of different denominations of different religions in the world. I just don't. I have found accomplishment and success and love and peace in my own inner strength and I've, I have a conscience, you know? So anyways, you do you, you do it the way you want to do it. I'm just, I'm on TikTok this morning because that's what I do on the Sabbath. <laughs> and I'm scrolling up. There's some lady like really into Jesus and she's reading scriptures and she's very passionate and the way she speaks is just like, just advocating the Lord. <laughs> Okay, cool, whatever. Um, it's just, it's just, I find it offensive. Look, if you have to associate yourself with people who came from a place that just like ruled and dominated by murder and genocide and your heavenly, invisible, mute, camera shy father deity thing is, you know, just this jealous God, maybe, I don't know, just reevaluate. You don't, whatever. You do you. <laughs> you find the peace that doesn't attract bigotry and discrimination if you find that it's divisive in your heart if, if it if you're involved in something or some group that's divisive it's not uniting it's not building bridges it's building walls <laughs> come on see for yourself anyways you do you i'm scrolling past that because that just almost made me vomit so i'm scrolling up and up and up here's some dude selling dude wipes <laughs> what Dude wipes is a thing. Now, I'm a huge advocate of baby wipes. And I guess when you grow up, you become a dude <laughs> if you're a man. I don't know. It's specifically targeted targeted <laughs> to dudes. And I guess it smells of fireworks and sandpaper or gasoline and, I don't know, Old Spice? I guess, I don't know what's so effective and great about this, but it's just another TikTok shop kind of a brand to sell. And I, I'm just, you know what? I'm ultimately grateful. I found the right baby wipes for me that I haven't stopped using since I was a baby. Like, I don't want streaks. And if you do the laundry in your house, you might have somebody who has, I don't know, tidy whities God, God, pray for those who still wear tidy whities God, please, if you're up there, Care Bear Land, pray for those who still wear tidy whities <laughs> Or the magic underwear, whatever that's called. But some guys are really sloppy. They scratch, they itch, they cause streakage. It's gross. Guys are gross. So I'm very grateful for whoever this was who, who, who thought of men who are so sloppy and can't just maintain themselves, you know, without baby wipes. But let's not call it baby wipes. Let's call it dude wipes, right? That's a lot cooler. I find my inner strength and peace within. <laughs> anyway. Look, you have to find the right baby wipe for you. This is sort of a segue to religion <laughs> because you want to be clean and pure. <laughs> you need to find the right baby wipe that suits your buttocks. <laughs> I found it. I found it in Kirkland brand. Yes, I'm not even on TikTok. I'm not getting paid. I'm not getting hearts and tapping screens. I just, I really like the Kirkland brand. I also like the uh, Walmart brand, whatever that is parents choice I don't know I found it to be strong durable and absorbent and yes I, I look I don't need to go into detail about my method of wiping and folding and wiping and folding and wiping and throwing in the trash can not the toilet in case the toilet is clogged from baby wipes that you should not flush look there's a whole science to it and science is good science is good okay that's all I gotta say much love to you on this black sabbath <laughs> Take care, y'all. Wipe that ass clean. Thanks. Bye.